The Hertz Donut Wave Folder, labeled Waveform Discontinuity, creates more complex waveforms and timbral changes without the use of a filter. The primary oscillator is wave-shaped using three types of wave folding. The three modes are based on the color of the LED at the top of this section. Let's learn more about each of these modes and how they work. The orange mode is an XOR-based or fractal wave shaper that's unique to the Hertz Donut. The red mode uses a discontinuous lookup table to perform nonlinear wave shaping. Finally, the green mode uses a more harmonic table to perform the wave shaping. The manual control on the right side adjusts the amount of wave shaping that's applied to the primary oscillator, but it also controls the duty cycle of the primary oscillator square output. There is a CV input available to the right of this section to modulate the amount of wave folding with an external control voltage between 0 and 5 volts. The amount of modulation applied can be controlled with the attenuverter to the left of this input. This control is bipolar, just like the others on the Hertz donut, which means your control voltage can be applied in the positive or negative direction. A little experimentation will help you find your favorite results for the types of sounds that you prefer. In our next video, we'll take a closer look at the modulation bus.